morning! Today I'm going to try making my first vlog. Maybe not worry about production value as much on my other, as on my other videos, which it's going to be really hard for me. I'm not very good at that kind of thing. Uh, I'm a bit, well, I'm a obsessive perfectionist, which isn't as cool as it sounds. It's kind of annoying. Too much information. <laughs> It is morning, we've got a bit of a late start. I'm up and washed, uh, that's about it so far. I need to finish getting ready and then we're gonna go get coffee because that's really important. Um, and then we're gonna go, I have to get a notebook so we're gonna go to my favorite kind of stationery store and we're gonna go to Olympic Village and have a roll around. It's gonna be interesting because one of my favorite things about other people's vlogs is when they talk and walk and you know show you around as they're, as they're moving but obviously in my wheelchair I need two hands to push so it's going to be kind of difficult to do that style of vlog um, I guess I need to figure out if this works out and I'm good at this which I'm not that good at anything yet so <laughs> if I'm good enough at it then I guess I need to figure out some kind of rig for my wheelchair so that I can mount my phone or a camera to my chair so I can vlog while I roll but today that's not going to happen so I guess I'll see you as the day progresses. Now existence, you see, is something that is spontaneous. Your hair grows by itself. Your heart beats by itself. You breathe pretty much by itself. Your glands secrete their essences by themselves. You don't have voluntary control over these things. So we say it happens spontaneously. Potted some pretty blossoms. I don't know what this tree is. I should probably look it up. I'm gonna try not to fill this vlog out with just footage of pretty flowers and trees. So who knows, maybe you like that too. Look at these weird, cool models in this antiques window. Yay, we're parked. Okay, so that was kind of a palaver. I didn't realize the sun run is on today. And so <laughs> we kind of had a lot of detours. But we are here a few blocks away from coffee, but that's okay, I have my wheelchair. So let's go get coffee. Getting a push, because I got tired. <laughs> Need a coffee. Half of it with one bite. Oh my god. Just had my coffee and extra coffee, so I'm really caffeinated. It's really sunny, which is nice, but it's making me really squinty. Here's where we've been. Except it's reverse because I'm using the front facing camera, but moving coffee really good they always treat us really well and best coffee in town I swear so I'm gonna link in the description below some information about moving coffee and now we're gonna roll on to Granville Island and go to my favorite stationery store and maybe get a donut I'm not obsessed with donuts I promise but donuts The thing about hills is they're really fun to come down but I know I have to go back up them to get home. So I wanted to take you the scenic route onto the island but there's stairs so we have to go the high traffic route instead. From about 10,000 feet at night or early morning you would see these great ganglia with tentacles going out all over the place. And early in the morning, you see little 
blobs of luminous particles going into the middle of the We made it onto Granville Island and I'm going to show you around now. There's lots of cool park areas around the island as you can see behind me. It's a little pond. It used to be an industrial island. Uh, all sorts of industry, I forget what now, when Vancouver was first developed, but now it has been converted into kind of a tourist spot. There's a nice indoor market and the art school is down here and there's lots of little boutiques and galleries and things like that. So I'm going to show you around. Can you see the turtle? I don't think I can get closer than this, sadly. Maybe if I was on my feet. Matthew's taking a picture of the turtle. You must go on. The reason is, you see, that we are not living in the eternal now. Where reality is. We are always thinking. This is a really cool water park that is really busy in the summer. Made it to my favorite stationery shop in Vancouver. It's called Papia and it's on Granville Island. And as you can see, it's behind me. I'll show you all the cool things they have. It varies all the time. They have lots of imported stationery and lots of local stationery too, from notebooks to pens to little gadgets. Yeah, you'll see, I guess. I'm here because I need a notebook for making notes. <laughs> you guess. Um, okay, see you inside. trying to get used to vlogging when there's people around. Um, we'll see if I can do this. I'm looking at the notebooks now. I barely fit in the spaces because of my wheelchair, but I make it work. There's so much choice. I don't know what to choose. I'll show you some of the books. I really like this one it's got birds on it and I'm kind of obsessed with birds um, but it's pink and I'm not really a pink person but then Matthew showed me this one how nice is that the color is I really love the color don't know if it'll show up but it's really nice so I might get that one I'm gonna keep looking though this is a cool unique notebook it looks like it's imported from Japan it has a really cool cover I don't know if I can show you kind of see-through. It's almost like vellum, which is kind of cool. Come on, focus. Focus. Yeah. There we go. You can kind of see. More notebooks. really like these German ones. They have lots of different covers down here. Oh my god, these are so cool. The little pack neighborhood patches for Vancouver. I think I'm gonna have to get one. I can see through here. I don't know if I can show you. It's Kitsilano, Vancouver, Gastown. Anyway, I think I'm gonna have to get one, maybe two. Eep. This is where I got my phone charm from. I have a cute little owl like these. Look what Matthew found. And a pencil. These are cool. I think they're the razors. They're cute little hedgehogs, all different colors. They're so cute. I have to try and limit myself for things that I buy, but... Oh, there's a monkey. You only have limited space for things, you know, but... <gasps> These are so cute. I have lots of weird dreams, so it would be cool to keep a journal, but... I'm pretty good at journals. I always try, but then I don't. 
These leather bags that they have in here are so nice, but they're so expensive. I like these cute earrings, they look like cephalopod suckers. Literally have everything. Yay, loot! Paper Yard is in a building called the Netlocks with a lot of other little boutiques. Hello! When it came to editing this video, I noticed that it was really long and probably too long for one video, so I've split it into two. If you like this half, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss the next installment. Next up is lunch on the island, a view of downtown, and donuts of course. And then I'll have my haul at the end that I got at Papia. Bye! Oh well. Say goodbye. Say goodbye.